morning guys, how are you doing? So I've just arrived in uh, Liverpool and uh, the last time I came to Liverpool was back in 2000 where there was the massive wave and dance event of Creamfields but today I've come to check out the city as I've not really seen a lot of Liverpool itself and I'm right by a place called Albert Dock where there's various things going on here and they do like the Merseyside cruise and it's known for the Beatles and the famous blind date with Stella Black and the famous football clubs of Liverpool FC etc. So let's check out Liverpool and check out what this amazing city has to offer. So it's a beautiful morning in Liverpool and we are now walking towards uh, out the dock and you've got an ice cream stall on your right hand side there if you want to get an ice cream you, you've got the pump house here which open from 12 o'clock to 11 p.m. which is good and it's a bank holiday weekend and I've come on the Sunday so I imagine it will be very busy today You've got another place to buy ice cream down there too. You can get a few beers down the nut pub if you want to. And just to give a quick view of where I am now. There you go, so you've got the bar there. You've got the Western Railway on that side and then you've got the Museum of Liverpool. And there you go. So there's a number of various places where you can get like snacks like ice cream or waffles if you want to. And you've got the old double decker bus straight up ahead too. So you've got the famous Merseyside Maritime Museum if you want to go and check that out. You've got various places where you can chill out if you want to, on those benches there. <laughs> so you've got the street food on this double-decker bus here, which is excellent. And let me show you where I am now. There you go. Very nice. So if you guys are looking for like really nice food and you want to go on the cruise, there's plenty of restaurants all the way around, way around here. And if you want to go on the cruise, you just go up to where this guy is. No need to book. And the good thing is to have a bar, which is excellent. So just to give you guys a bit of information about that. And now we're going to move to find other things that's happening around this Albert Dock. You've got a statue on this left hand side here which people that are uh, taking pictures and stuff <laughs> and if I walk down here I'll give you a view of the River Mersey and the cruise as well I and mean, look at that guys just look at that. And now in the distance, you've got a cruise going on there too, which is good. And then you've got the bridge on this side here too. Uh, 
is an absolute glorious morning in Liverpool. Excuse me. It's all right. So you've got entertainment, so you've got some buskers playing the trumpet there. And then you've got the famous statue of the horse on that side there too, and then you've got the view where I've just come from. Yeah, that's my first time to Liverpool since back back in 2000 and I like it so far. So if you, if you walk along here towards right down that way you'll notice there's a lot of padlocks where people leave the names and stuff. I mean look at that one there too. You've got you got this one here. So there's so many like People leave a memory of the padlock with their names and stuff. Right up ahead you've got the beautiful coos on that left hand side there. So I'll try and get closer to that so I can get a good view of it. You've got the Museum of Liverpool on this side here too. When you walk down here, you'll notice quite a few of these like um, statues on that side there, as you can see there too. So let me just show you guys that. Check it out. Look at that there. So you got that one. So you got the lightning seeds. I remember the sign freelance on the shirt for the England anthem. And then further along here there's a couple more statues down on this side here too. So I'll show you guys that. And check it out you guys. Look at this one here. Look at that too. So you got that one, and then you've got this one here too. There you go. So a couple of statues to check out if you come to the Royal Albert Dock. And you can see it's not too busy on this side at the moment, which is good. And uh, you can cycle down here. Plenty of places to walk. Plenty of things to do here. Right up ahead you've got the Mersey Ferries too. So for you guys looking for city bakes in England and you know limited to travelling where you want to go then why not check out Liverpool? I'll show you here the view. I know you've got the River Mersey there. And then you've got the cruise out down there. More places to get snacks and stuff if you want to get some snacks. So if you guys are staying in Liverpool and you want to go to the Isle of Man, we have to go to Alaman on that side and uh, a lot of people that chill out here as you can see and then you've got the famous cruise right there that is as close as I can get to it on the thread but it looks very nice and just in case you want to know where the Liverpool cruise terminal is just on that side there you've got the Clown Plaza Hotel 
you've got the beautiful statue right here as you can see too and there you have it and then you've got information now too about this statue let me see if I can get a closer view of that cruise There you go guys, that is the best I can do. And there you go, absolutely glorious. So I've managed to find a road that leads close up to this Queen Elizabeth cruise ship here. Look at it guys, absolutely beautiful. If I get a closer view there, you know, people taking pictures. Look at it. People are chilling out. There you have it, guys. <laughs> So after spending almost two hours in Liverpool, uh, I really like Liverpool, really nice and uh, the people who I've met so far have been really friendly and uh, I've checked out Albert Dock which looks really cool and then I've checked out the River Mersey side, or the River Mersey shall I say, and uh, right behind me You've got the amazing cruise, which looks absolutely fantastic. So I'd love to know where it's going to. You've got a restaurant behind me too. So if you guys are looking to go to a restaurant, then this restaurant is called the Cargo Restaurant and Bar. So if you guys come to this restaurant and then you sat on these benches here, you get a good view of the cruise whilst uh, having lunch so I'm now gonna go on a cruise myself but not on this type of cruise obviously and then I'm gonna grab some lunch and then uh, I'm gonna check out some other tourist stuff in Liverpool I want to show you something really cool. You seen the old bus there, the old American school bus? It's really cool, isn't it? It's taking all the burgers, fast food. I'll show you where I am now. I'm coming towards the end of my day in Liverpool and I just wish I had more time here. So let me give you a view here. 
absolutely stunning. And then right down here, that is Vedo City of Liverpool. And that's the old bus right there. And then up here, you've got the ferries wheel. And what I've noticed is, sweet to this car gets past me. What I've noticed is, you can actually rent like a scooter to hop around. So if you're in the Albert Dock area and you want to rent a scooter, you can, which is pretty cool. And if you're looking for a place to stay, you've got the Jewies Inn Hotel up here. And you've got the ferries wheel right there, as you can see. So if you come to Liverpool, there are plenty of hotels to stay at. And if you're looking for a restaurant to eat nearby here, well, you've got the Pizza Express, I think it is, right on this corner here. And there's some activity going down, on down there too. So if you come to Liverpool guys, you're going to need more than a day here. I mean, I suggest coming here for maybe two or three days here. There's so much stuff to do here. You know, it's absolutely incredible. It really is. And up here you've got the M&S Bank Arena. Which is good too. to end it for my trip in Liverpool today I've had an absolute fantastic day and uh, just before we sign off today I just want to show you where I am so right here is where the Sun is going down tonight and it is absolutely fantastic here you know and it's coming up towards sunset here and just look at the reflection there on London River Mersey here. You know, just this is just outside the M and S Bank of Ena. And there you go. So there you are guys. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. I'd love to stay longer in Liverpool obviously. But you know you really get so much time don't you? And I've only had one day to enjoy Liverpool. Absolutely enjoyed it. Went to the Liverpool Museum today. Went for the cruise which cost seven pound and then I went for a really nice Thai meal at the Rosie restaurant just near the River Mersey. Absolutely fantastic place, good food, good value for money. And uh, I had a satay for a star and then I had a, a curry, I forget the name of the curry now, but the food was really good. And uh, that's it. So thanks a lot for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. I'll be coming back next year to do other things that I've not done in Liverpool and uh, hope to see you guys in the next one. Stay safe and stay healthy.